Stocks closed higher last Friday, a day after the market suffered its biggest loss in six weeks. The Dow gained 35 points, the Nasdaq edged up two. Long lines at Seattle's SeaTac International Airport have passengers regularly missing flights. And now the director of the facility says he's considering all options to get things moving more efficiently, including replacing the TSA with private security contractors. A hearing is scheduled for the end of the month on this controversial alternative. Dave & Buster's plans to open up to 10 new locations this year. The Dallas-based chain says they made $867 million in revenue last year, up more than 16 percent from 2014. The first three locations are scheduled to open in Rochester, New York, El Paso, Texas, and Capitol Heights, Maryland, opening hundreds of jobs. Six months after launching a pilot program in San Francisco and New York City, Best Buy will soon offer same-day delivery in 11 more cities, including Washington, D.C., Dallas, Atlanta, Boston, and Miami. Under the service, online shoppers would need to place their orders by 3 p.m. and can expect their purchases by 9 p.m. for an additional fee of $10 to $20 per order. And that's your CBS Money Watch report. For more, log on to cbsmoneywatch.com. In New York, I'm Hannah Daniels.